uh, <coughs> it is January 30th, 2010, <coughs> on a Saturday morning at 11.41 a.m., and we are going, we are on Corinth Road, which is also a highway, I don't know what the highway name is, but it's Corinth, leaving Corinth area, going towards Johnson City. We got about five inches of snow last night, <coughs> and this morning, stopped about 6 a.m., and I'm driving home from work. I would have videotaped when I was driving to work, but it was at uh, 2 a.m., and there was so much, it was dark, for one, it, my camera wouldn't have picked up much, and there's so much blowing snow, and issues I just wanted to focus on driving but this is the nice countryside back here covered in snow this road was almost impossible I mean if you were in a in a vehicle that wasn't made good for snow you wouldn't have been able to come down this road about 2 a.m. when I came through because uh, I had to make my own roads there was no tracks nothing I had to judge the whole physics of what each side looked like you know where the ditch is and just make my own tracks in my 4x4 four four pickup here you gotta love a Dodge I had absolutely no problems in four-wheel drive uh-huh But yeah, it's, if you could see it back there, you can see the trees that are down. There's all sorts of trees down. That's from our May 8th Dechero storm. And I mean, it's crazy because you can see them better. You know, like here's some up here. I can see a few in there and you can see them better because all the snow and everything, you know, there's no leaves on the trees. And it's nuts. There's a little ways back I should have videotaped. I don't know why I didn't. But uh, there's hundreds, hundreds, I'm serious, hundreds, if not 200, 300 of trees down in the woods. And they're all uprooted from that storm with 106 mile per hour winds, straight line. <coughs> A progressive echo it was. You can see my videos of that day on YouTube as well. Just search for them. But, yeah, this little storm went to the market. <coughs> That's a pretty good little storm, though. The snowstorm came through. There's a lot of roads that are covered. And I'd go down them just for the fun of it, because I can make it, but I need to go get gas and cigarettes and heron, so I'm just going to go on and go on to heron. <coughs> or I could do John City, but eh, I'll go to heron. <coughs> Oh yeah, here we go. Here's those trees. You can see them all there. Those are the storm damaged trees right there. Look at them. That is nuts. That is freaking nuts. Gosh. Look at them all. That's what that storm did. I'd have hate to have been out in the woods walking when that storm came through. I don't know why I'd do uh, out in them woods walking around, but if I was, that would suck. Because I'd be dead. Or in pain. Or... I'd poop myself or something. I'll let someone drive through here so they don't think, think I'm videotaping them. Oh, here we go. We've got more scenery. We're in Johnson City now. <coughs> Johnson City, Illinois. Southern Illinois, Williamson County. Oh, there's a Presley sign. Vote Dennis Presley for sheriff. He's a good guy. <clears throat> Johnson City last night about 2 something a.m. when I drove through was pretty <coughs> snowy, but I noticed their plows were out, so that's a good thing. They were out and working. And there's a plow guy plowing the bank up here, too. I remember that. Up here by the tracks. Now the roads are not so bad. I wish I could have videotaped it earlier, but like I said, I was I was doing my best to 
drive and not get in a wreck because this old 4x4 four four can't do everything. Yeah, I'd say. Well, I'm going to shut this off for now and I'll maybe turn it on later depending on if I find anything worth videotaping. So, remember to check out my Meteorology and Climate Forum at www.weatherbb.com. There's a forum on there, you can see. It's a good forum, and I'll talk to you later.